Mickey Mouse here. Well, this is a Disney movie nostalgia review. Continuation of the Walt Disney Animation Studios. These are the package films that was released in the 1940s. But they're not like theatrical films, but they're just packaged because of the financial problems from the 1940s. So, anyway, what I was always fan to tell you about what the next movie is. Great, yeah, pal. Mickey, Mickey. As Mickey told you, um, these are like the package films that was used from the 1940s because they've been going through some financial problems. So, instead of just making theatrical films, well, they're almost like theatrical, but um, they're just not like big movies. So, this is one of them. It's called Make My Music. This one is just like the idea of Fantasia, except no orchestration um, background or anything like that, so... So if you were thinking about this, like, hey, good, this is going to be as good as Fantasia. Well, not quite, but I'll explain that in a little bit. Okay, um, for this film, it has 10 different segments. One, the marches and the coys. That one was banned because of the graphic gunfighting between two groups. But hopefully one of these days they're going to release on Blu-ray to have it right on it. Because it should have been banned in the first place, you know? Oh, well. And also, there's Blue by You. All the cats join in. Without You. Casey and At the Bat. To Solitis. I think that's what it's called. Peter and the Wolf. After You're Gone. Johnny Fedora and Alice Blue Bonnet. And of course, my favorite, but pretty sad at the end. The Whale Who Wanted to Sing at the Met. These segments, directed by five different directors and different writers. Um, show their showcase about how how each segment shows about like music, fun, and entertainment. Um, let's see. Now, as I'm gonna say, um, to me, this is an enjoyable film. It is, especially shows like how these artists go through different stories for each and one of them. I thought that was a good idea. It reminds me just like watching Fantasia. Okay, here comes the bad. Um, there's two bad things about that. One is just a tad little bit boring, especially for anyone who's like, it's like, oh, this could be good as Fantasia. It may not be because it's just not as strong as Fantasia. It's it's a thing that they do to make the film look good, but unfortunately, it, f- it falter from the Fantasia itself. But, however, oh yeah, and also, um, then... This may not be as memorable as like the other Disney films we've seen as well. There, it's like another second tier of the films. I thought this is a. I still think it's still a great movie, and I thought parents and children will love this film, despite of uh, the Martin Mc- and the Coys been um, banned. But I hope they unban that and put it right into the movie on Blu-ray one of these days. So we'll see what happens. Anyway. Due to the two faults, I'm going to give it 4 plus. Still, great movie. Um, if you, um, someday they'll probably put it on Disney movies everywhere. If you do, rent it, go for it. it. This might be a good film for you. Anyway, go ahead, Mickey. Well, that is all the time we have today. If you like this and more, just follow us down here and also subscribe below. And you all have a magical night.